<laughs> yeah, they would not. That's right. Bring her on up here, girl. Bring that little country mom on up here. Now, you all remember when I was talking about Jan Thursday night? You remember what I said? Don't repeat it, okay? What did you say? I just, um, I tell you, I am so privileged to have each and every one of you as, as part of this Christian family. And, uh, man, I tell you, if God would allow me to, I would beat up anybody that messed with you. <laughs> he hadn't allowed me to do that. But he's allowed me to pray for all of you, to try to be the best friend in the whole wide world that I can be. And I, I'm telling you something, this is from the bottom of my heart. One of the people who's taught me more about how to be a friend than anybody in this world is Jan Krauts, because she's been a friend to me and set free. This is a total surprise to me, too. I just came to be in the audience today just to wish one of the people that I see Jesus in more than anybody that I have ever met. Amen. And <laughs> I've met a few people in my life. <laughs> You know, it isn't, it isn't what the whole wide world almost thinks that Christianity is, that Christianity really is. Jesus lets us know over and over that true Christianity is doing the works of Jesus. Not talking, <clears throat> not building buildings, not big crusades, not even television networks. But it's those that are doing the works of Jesus. And someday every one of us are going to look into those beautiful blue eyes of Jesus. And we've read in Josephus that they are blue. <laughs> <clears throat> And we're going to look and see. And he is going to say to us several things. And among them are, did you feed the hungry? Did you clothe the naked? And did you house the homeless? Did you visit those in prison and those that were sick? Now that's the words that Jesus Christ is going to ask us. The very first time I ever saw Pastor Phil, the first thing I heard about him from my secretary, Joni, is, Jan, there is a pastor that is taking the homeless right into his home and feeding the hungry and clothing the naked. And I said, Joni, no, not today in this world. There's not such a person. She said, oh, yes, there is. And I couldn't wait until I met Pastor Phil. And Pastor, I saw Jesus in you, and I still see Jesus Amen. in you every day. <laughs> That's wonderful. Jan, I'll tell you, isn't this a combo? Don't we look like buddies that would hang on the streets? Doesn't she look like she'd ride a Harley Davidson, huh? We're going to the convention. Yeah. <laughs> Next week, we're going to be in, in Texas together, and a whole bunch of our servants for Christ, our bikers, we're all going to be on a, in, a, in a little uh, Texas motorcycle, Jesus happening, and Jan Crouch is going to be riding in on one of them Harley Davidsons with us. So pray for her. Nice. <laughs> and and uh, I think uh, Fern is going to sing our favorite song in the world. You want to say something first, bro? I'd like to say a lot of things. I want you to stand right there. But this lady here can sing happy birthday. <laughs> the... Now this is, she had no idea I was gonna do this. She can sing happy birthday like I've only heard one other lady sing it. And I, I would like for her to sing happy birthday. To... Whoa. Is anybody hiring out there? Is anybody looking for a singer? 
I might, I might come, I might call you tomorrow. <laughs> Jan, I would like you to sing happy birthday to Pastor Phil. Jan. Thank you, Jan Krauts. Thank you for that beautiful birthday cake. I promise you we will eat that today. Right now, go ahead and be...